Here is an example of a strategy with an accelerating equity curve. It is the VIX swing strategy you see here. Um, it's been in a nice equity curve and then it pops. This is the closed trade equity curve. It does not show the drawdowns. This is by far the best performing uh, stock index strategy that has uh, worked over the last couple of years that we have. Um, incredible results, but it does not have a stop loss. So we do not use it. Um, we had been using the uh, money management algorithm version of this, which waits for a $3,000 drawdown to start. And I'll show you that in a minute. But because uh, we haven't had a $3,000 drawdown in a while, uh, one of the recommendations that we mentioned was to trade this um, with a $3,000 stop loss. Since it does not use a 3,000, this is not does not use a stop loss at all. Um, it's a strategy that could be traded with a $3,000 stop loss. You could wait for it to go into a little bit of a losing trade. Here's an ex example of um, the strategy here. Um, it's taken this trade today, um, and if you get in um, at a little bit of a loss and then wait for um, trade it, and if it goes into a $3,000 loss, you stop. And um, that's when the money management algorithm version would have picked it up. But the money management algorithm version that we were using uh, waits for a $3,000 loss to start. And then that version also, that version actually has a stop loss. So um, here is uh, the trades. It captured this, this um, straight up move that we had from the, from the beginning of this year, 2018. Uh, and you see that move up and it captured that move. And so... Would have been a good time to have that strategy in retrospect, but again, we, we aren't trading it yet because um, it doesn't have a stop loss. The money management algorithm version, which I'm going to show you next, does have a stop loss. I'm going to show you that. Here is the money management algorithm version, and I'm going to scroll back to when it when it last traded here. It was in 2016 when this strategy last traded, and so I have to scroll back a little bit. Here are some of the last trades in September. Of 2016, here is the performance summary for this strategy. So it's a it has a nice equity curve. This gets in when the original strategy goes into a $3,000 drawdown. It trades with a $1,000 stop loss and a actually a $500 stop loss and a $1,000 profit target. So um, let me let me verify that quickly. So yeah, a $500 uh, stop loss, $1,000 profit target. Here is the performance graph on that, and here is the performance summary. And so it trades much less. And this is this is back to um, 1/11/2015. So when this strategy does go into a drawdown, which means the market will have a little bit of a correction, could be a time, good time to start trading it. Um, and it was in the portfolios. We've just taken it out for now because. The market has not gone into a drawdown in a while. But we may add it back later when it goes into a drawdown, when the market goes down and has a correction and then starts moving higher. Or if, um, you know, one, one, one approach would be to trade the original base strategy until it goes into a $3,000 drawdown. If, if the market continues to move higher, if it continues doing what it's doing now, um, you would only risk $3,000 per contract to trade the original version. And then, um, then if it went into a $3,000 drawdown, you could turn this strategy on, and your risk would be about uh, $3,000 on the original strategy plus $5,000 on this strategy, and so that would be $8,000 $8, risk to um, phase into this these strategies that are um, the strategy that is capturing these market moves. Uh, you see that in the um, here in the base strategy see some of the trades here are some of the winning trades here are some of the losing trades it's long only and it buys dips and so um, that is VIX swing and you don't oftentimes see accelerating equity curves where it just pops much higher uh, the trend line is up and then it pops much higher you don't see that much uh, that tells you how well this strategy has been doing but also it tells you how extreme this move in the market is um, just straight up uh, potentially euphoric you don't see um, investors throwing money at the market the way you did in the dot-com bubble but 
um, this price action is is pretty extreme. So that is the VIX swing strategy and one of the strategies that is calling the current market environment.